<laughs> Renee finished my thought for me. I forgot. <laughs> and, and, uh, and I forgot. Yeah, I, I got to put this. <laughs> I got to put this uh, this little kid into place because uh, like they don't have faith because they believe it's not a choice. Now, we, the choice, what have the free will comes in is that God is drawing all men unto Himself. He's the light that lighteth every man that cometh into this world. And if somebody uses their free will to respond to that light, God will give them more understanding. He will give them more light. And when they respond to that, he'll give them more. If they respond to that, they'll give them more. And then there's finally enough light that the understanding they, to where they can understand with their heart and that they believe by that and they're able to place use the faith that god has given them and place it in the cross alone okay so the free will comes in to the fact that are you going to respond to the light that god's drawn every man and he wants every man to come unto him well then it is a you choice. respond to them to that light god does more work all you have to do no man seeks after god it's god seeking after us and so you respond to God and he gives you more. You respond to him. The free will is responding to him. It's not going out there and uh, making yourself believe. That's make believe. <laughs> so it's about going out there and saying, God, if you're true, show me in your word. And then he will. Show no, you. it's taking your faith, taking the faith that God has given to you. Because it says that God hath dealt to every man the measure of faith. You take that and you put that on the blood of Jesus Christ. And it's not the faith that actually saves you. It's the it's Christ that saves you. It's the object of faith. He is saved by the blood. Just rebuking a, a well, brother. I mean, if you didn't, <laughs> I don't know. People, people just, it doesn't matter. It, how you word it is always going to be nitpick. You know, every, everything you say, Matthias, will be nitpicked because they, they don't like your doctrine. That's all. Doesn't matter. Not, nothing. They'll say, they'll say they're saved uh, and agree with the doctrine of salvation, but actually then try to say that yeah, I don't even I don't even get it there. The last one was that I that we don't have faith because we believe faith is something it's a it's a gift or that I don't even know, it's ridiculous. No, I believe I believe it's yeah, a gift. I, I, I'm I would almost say it may not be uh, an abomination. It, it may be straight up attacks. I'm not sure. Yeah, I don't understand. Like even if people disagree with you or me or any any of us, Luke on doctrines that aren't essential to salvation why would you try to stop the preaching or come against someone who is clearly promoting christ crucified yeah renee now you made me remember what i was trying to talk to you eternal judgment is fundamental what who who said that Oh, that Luke guy? Are you serious? That's blasphemy. He said God was evil. Oh, my. Mm, wicked. He's a blasphemer, man. I'll need to. When that live chat is gone, I'll need to check that. I'll need to check that. Hopefully, the closed captions are there so I can check it out fast. I need to check that. I think that every every oh and sorry by the way if i'm i'm talking low like whispering because it's very late right here so that's why <laughs> that they hold wrong so uh if you say something contrary to what they say then you must be a heretic and, and so they part of it is coming from the people who have actually they, they've invested a lot of time studying but it's gone to their head and it got all puffed up uh and then I think some of it also is coming from, I think Marvel mentioned it early on about some of the people being so young. The, uh, 